Welcome biologists to part three of spec point G. In this video we're going to have a look at CO dilutions. So the reason why we do a CO dilution is to try and identify how many bacteria I have within the original solution. Quite often if I was to put my original culture, my highly concentrated culture, straight onto a petri dish, I'm going to have too many colonies growing to count. So I need to dilute and do a serial dilution in order to produce different plates and select the right one which has just about uh, the most countable colonies which will have the smallest impact upon anomalous results. It'll also be more representative of the larger population and it also decreases the chance of error. So in this particular case the plate that I would pick here is this one here. It has the most countable colonies, it'll have the smallest impact on um, anomalous information and be more representative of the original culture that we have over here. So once you've um, found the plate that you want to use, you then put it into a formula that looks like this to calculate the number of colonies within the original culture. So if I chose this plate here, plate 71, I'd put that into my uh, formula like so. Now this formula is not provided in the exam. It is also worth noting here that if I do a hundredth dilution each time I do this dilution, so instead of pipetting one mil out, I pipette 0.1 mil out, and I also dilute it up to 10 milliliters using distilled water, I would put here 100 to the power n. However, because I'm diluting by a series of a serial dilution of a tenth each time, I'm putting uh, times to the power 10 n here, with n being the number of times I do a, t a serial dilution here. So you can see here I've got 71. 71 is the number of colonies on this plate divided by the volume plate, which you can see here is one mil, and then times in that by 10 to the power two, 10 because I'm diluting by 10 each time and I've diluted twice to get to that particular culture, that third one. I'm then gonna times by the original volume in the um, original solution, which in this case is one mil in the original solution, which gives me 7.1 times 10 to the three. Here's another example if you want to pause this and have a go using this formula that we've just looked at. If you want to pause that and have a go now. But for this one, I should be getting, doing this serial dilution, I should be getting this answer. So that's the formula you should be using and I should be getting 6 times 10 to the 5. Uh, here's another example if you want to pause this and have a go again using that formula. And this is what we should have got for this one. Should have got um, that's the formula I should have used. The substitutions and three times ten to the five, and another one. And here again is the answer. So those are relatively straightforward questions. Here are some that are slightly more difficult, very typical on the exam. These kind of questions. So again, pause this for a second and have a go. Okay. So here is the answer to this one. So I should be doing fifteen over zero point one times ten to the two times 25, which gives me 3.75 times 10 to the 5. This is probably one of the more difficult questions that I've seen on CO dilutions. Again, you pause the video and have a go, but a tip here, if, you want, if you're interested, is that you will need to rearrange the formula for this one. So pause that and have a go now. Okay, and this is what we should have done for this. So I'm trying to find out the number of colonies here, which is why I've got X here, and all the other numbers I can substitute in. So if I rearrange the formula, like so, and then I can isolate the X in the next one, like so. I can then work out that the total number of colonies that I'm expecting is 50. So there we are, that is zero dilution using a really important formula that is not provided in the exam to help you to work out all of the answers. Guys, good luck in your exam, and I wish you all the best with your um, studies, and I ask you, like the video, comment below and click subscribe. All the best.